Hey, what's up, you guys? Welcome. Today, we're going to be playing Gone Home. This is a game that I got to watch a lot growing up because one of my favorite content creators played it, and I've always wanted to play it for myself, and now I get the opportunity to do that. I'm super excited. It is an indie game. Uh, it's got some pretty cool art, pretty cool music, so I hope you're ready. But before I start, I just want to say, if you do like this video and want to see more videos like this, be sure to hit that subscribe button. It helps out so much and it gives me the opportunity to produce more content like this. Also, if you want to be notified every time I post a video, hit the bell icon. That way you'll get a notification for every time I post. With that, let's get into it. New game. Start. Bright Company presents. Hi, Mom. Uh, so I got my ticket home from Europe. I get back on June 6th, but it's a really late flight because that was the cheapest, so it gets in at midnight. But don't worry, I'll get a shuttle from the airport so you don't have to pick me up. Like, really seriously, you don't have to. Okay, so love you. See you soon. Bye. Wait, can I turn... Can I turn... Oh my god. Oh, hold on, hold on. That's so loud. The rain was entirely too loud. Wait, uh... Okay. Well, oh my gosh. The rain is so loud. Turn lamp on. Okay, so there are a few things. How do I squat? Shift. Okay, shift. Oh, no, shift to zoom. I can zoom in on things? Oh, God, I have a cup. How do I pick things up? Hmm. Press right mouse. Really shift. Okay. I want to... How do I squat? Control. Okay. I have a duck. Ooh, there's a key. I have a key. Can I not? Can I? Okay, so I can... <gasps> I can look at the duck. This is... Okay. The first few minutes of this are probably just going to be me figuring out how this works. Are these my bags? Yes, this is my name. Caitlin. Okay. There's a window. Ah... I'm a little nervous. It's a little dark. What is this? Fizz right. Ginger rail. Hmm. Alright. Let's see. Oh. There is a note. Katie, I'm sorry I can't be there to see you, but it's impossible. Please, please don't go digging around trying to find out where I am. I don't want anyone to know. Oh, uh, the lights. We should, we, wait, bleh, we, mm, we'll see each other again someday. Don't be worried, I love you. Sam. Okay, so there's a lot of things that just happened. It's a nice house. It's a very nice house. Hmm. Okay, well, we are going to turn every single lamp on because I'm already afraid. This isn't a scary game. I don't think. I don't know though. Lamp, lamp, lamp. I wanna turn the lamp on. Read note. Sam, Daniel from the old neighborhood called. He wants to come see the new house. Call him back. Mom, Daniel is a total weirdo. The only reason I ever hung out with him in the first place is we had a Nintendo when we were little. Okay. Um, are there any more lights that I could turn on before I... I would like to close this. I don't want to do that yet. There's a big front room. There's a bunch of stuff in here. 
tissue box. I don't know why that's important. Oh, I threw it. I'm so scared I'm gonna turn around and there's just gonna be like a person, but it's fine. Uh, there's nothing there. So there's something in here. Read note, yes. Directions to the new, to work from the new house. Uh, Arbor Hill. I think that's, an hour? An hour and 10 minutes to work? I, I that just scared me for an unknown reason. Nothing in there? Okay. Um, we will look this way first. Drawer. A letter. Oh, okay. Dear Jan, it's so good to hear from you again. All this new house business sounds like quite the adventure. Oh my god, that thunder. Remember the little dorm room we shared freshman year when we were miserable fantasizing about our dream homes? I always said I wanted a mansion. You said you just wanted a house in the woods. Look who got both. Somebody up there likes you. Oh, okay. Uh, I could use some of that magic. Send me some lotto numbers. I'll play them. Seriously. But I shouldn't be complaining about this good old split level. Good old split level we've had since Bob got transferred to Winnipeg. We just got new vinyl siding. Jealous yet? Let me know if you ever want to trade places. So, how are the girls doing? Has Katie left on her big European adventure yet? Speaking of jealous. Right back soon. I miss you, Rumi. Carol. I don't know how important that was to read. Anything down here? Let's see. Boone County. That must be where we are. No, no, turn on. Uh, if I do that, don't be surprised if I freak out. Uh, anything in these? No. Uh, trophies. Pick up one of my trophies. I don't want to pick it up. I'll just look at it. Track. Track. This is... Skull. This is another track trophy for Katie. Caitlin. Caitlin. That's... Okay. I don't want to go upstairs yet. Open folder. Read invoice. So this is just an invoice for, like, where boxes go? The library has so many boxes. Dang. Dear Katie, so much has changed, even just since you've been away. We moved into this house. I'm at a new school. And my big sister being gone for a year doesn't make it any easier. It doesn't feel real. But I'm not gonna let it phase me. I used to tell you everything, and if I can't do it in person, because you're off gallivanting around who knows where, I'll tell it to this journal. Just like I was talking to you. Okay. That must, that was Sam, I'm guessing. At the new house, added to backpack. How do I hit my... Okay, so this is map items. Oh, is that me? Aw, she's cute. Boarding pass from Amsterdam. Portland, Cincinnati. We're in Cincinnati. Spare key. Journals. Okay, so I can listen to the journals again if I want to. And the map, I'm guessing, will build. Uh, itinerary. Katie's departure. 1994. Okay. So we in the 90s. Wow, okay, so she did the, oh, did she do, like, these? Okay. Well, because, um, we're just gonna pretend that she just went to Europe. Can I? <sighs> Noises are stressing me out. Play messages. Sam. Sam. Hello. Sam! Oh my gosh, who is this? Okay. Is that Daniel? Sam, where are you? What the heck? Really? I need to talk to you. 
Oh, that seems kind of important. Please be there. Oh. Wait, that's kind of. Hi, mom. Uh, okay, so I got my ticket sweet. home from Europe. I get back on June sixth, but it's a really late flight. Okay. Because... I don't need to hear that again. I heard that the first time. That second message is a little upsetting, a little concerning. How many doors? Why is this house so big? This is a bathroom. I don't know if there's anything important. Can I? Why are we the lights not turn on? Is there anything important in here? I don't know. I'm gonna close that door. Uh, I don't wanna do this. I don't like opening doors. Okay. Pull string. Close door. Janice. I think that's mom. I think over the Alps. Okay, uh, I don't need that. Put back. Boxes, boxes. Good fellow high school. That must be where Sam goes, maybe? Open door. I'm standing in the way. Close door. Grab tissue box. Put back. What is this? Read card. Have a go uh, dog gone 17th birthday. Happy birthday, Sam, from Uncle Harvey. Don't know who Uncle Harvey is, but that seems pretty cool. Sam is 17, as I have found out now. Uh, okay, so it's locked. That That's totally okay. But if this one is also locked, that means I have to go upstairs, and I'm not ready to go upstairs yet, so... Okay, that's a hallway. Uh, I would like to take a moment to reassess. I'm gonna stand right here. Uh, in the corner and uh, reassess the fact that I'm in a big house uh, by myself and I don't like big houses. I'm hearing things. Oh my god. Um, I know I can take stuff with me. I would like to take something. This is intense. I don't like scary games. I'm gonna take the tissue box with me. We're gonna be friends. Do you hear that? Oh my god, I'm gonna lose it. Oh, I guess I have to make the decision. Okay. I also don't like that lights flicker. This could literally be the room from The Shining. Hey, it's one of the postcards I sent. Let's look at it. Oh, just kidding. Paris. Oh, this is gonna be a lot of reading. Hi, Mom, Dad, and Sam. I'm in Paris. I've done many... Parisian things, including eating. Oh, I'm not gonna try to read that. I did take French. That's not important though. Wearing a beret. I'm going to have lots of film to develop when I get back. Is she a film student? That's cool. Or is she just taking pictures because it's 1994? Sam, I'm bringing you back something from the Shakespeare Book Company since you are my favorite sister. Love you all. Katie. Weird. Oh, because it's the new address. That's cool. Um, while all the doors are closed. Open, okay, nothing there. Uh, who's this? There is no writing on it. Okay, obituary. Oscar Doc Mason, Oscar Mason, 60, of Boone County, died peacefully last month in his home. Mr. Mason was born on September 8th in 1993 in a house that would be his home for the rest of his life. He attained his degree in pharmacy at a young age and returned to Boone County practice. He quickly became a well-loved figure at the center of the community. In decades preceding his passing, he was seldom seen outside his house, so he was a hermit. Um... A service will be held. I'll welcome his survivors, include his nephew Terrence Greenbrier. That's Katie's last name, so that must be Dad. So this must be Uncle. Uh, as well as in spirit, the people. Of Bo oh my God! The thunder is so loud. Anyways, he died. Cards, cards, very cool. Um, I'm gonna put this photo on the desk. It seems important. What is this? Okay, it's a closet. I'm fine locking myself in closet. Uh, read note. 
Welcome new student. We hope that you're as excited about your first day at Goodfellow High School as we are. Please be sure to bring the following with you on your first day of classes so that you can get right into the swing of things. A list of... The music just started again out of nowhere and it kind of scared me. Please remember to get plenty of sleep the night before and be ready for the first bell to ring at 8 a.m. See you soon and again, welcome. Beth Valence. Valence. Va yes. Ooh, another one. Oh my god. You are so lucky you finished high school before we moved into this house. So, it's the first day of school, and there I am, introducing myself to the class. And I say that I just moved into the house on Arbor Hill. All of a sudden, every kid in the room turns and just stares like I suddenly transformed into a mutant. They just stood there, wishing pretty hard for a rewind button. Because now maybe nobody knows my name, but they all know who I am. The Psycho House Girl. Wait. Great. Wait. 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 Um, you're not just gonna say that like you didn't just say that. Um, okay, okay, um. Is there something I should know about the house? Is there, is there something I should know about the house? Oh, there's a piece of... This is terrifying. Um... Uh, it makes me very nervous. There's so much, like, stuff everywhere. Oh my god. Oh my gosh. Uh, this is making me terrified. I'm scared. I'm just gonna, like, see somebody. Read. Okay. Hey, are you the new girl, Sam? I'm Tommy. I'm on the back behind you. Wave if you get this and write back. Hi, Tommy. Yes, I'm Samantha, and yes, I'm new. What's up? I just thought since you're new, maybe you could use a friend. I don't have a lot of friends either. So I thought I could ask something if you don't mind. Do you mind? No. No, I don't mind. What did you want to ask? Was it just your uncle who went psycho, or does it run in the family? Okay, um, oh, uh, okay, uh, we're gonna stand in this corner really quick, because what does that mean? I read his obituary, said he died peacefully in his sleep. Am I being lied to? Am I being lied to? I would like to turn on all the lights. It just, it, it does not seem bright enough in here. I would like all of the lights on. Oh, um, actually... Well, okay, now that I've turned the fan on, I guess it's fine. Um, there's a bunch of stuff. What is this? It's the book that Dad wrote. So Dad is a writer. Is this, is this about JFK? Okay, Dad's a conspiracy theorist, and he writes books. A mom works at the park? This is a letter... Hey man, how have you been? I know you're a published author. Okay, so yeah, Dad's an author. I think he writes conspiracy theories. That looks like a conspiracy theory book. This seems to be like it's from an editor. I don't want to read everything because it's going to take forever, but you can always pause it if you want to read it. What is this? A cassette tape. Girl Scout. Role model. Let's put in role model. Oh. That's very cool. Can I flip it to Girl Scout? Oh, no, it only plays role model. Okay, that's very cool. It's mom's old work mug. Why is this important? I don't think it is. TV listing, The X-Files, so... Hey, that's my birthday! But like, you, you guys heard that, right? That wasn't just me. Is there? I'm alone! I should be alone. That There was definitely a noise. Anyways, that's my birthday. Um, that's all that's important. Um, what does this book say? 
Sam thought this might help dad. Making friends even when you feeling lonely. It's a piece of cake to make friends. Aw, okay. Um, gross. You know oh, that wait. feeling Another where time. the first moment you see someone, it's like they have a big gold star around them and you have to get to know them. So Sam made a friend. Well, there's this girl. Mm. I think she's a senior. She's usually dressed kind of punk, but sometimes I see her in this, like, army uniform. She's always drawing in this notebook, looking so intense. So I had no idea how I would ever, like, have an excuse to talk to her. Till I noticed she and her friends hang out and play Street Fighter at the 7-Eleven every day after school. Okay, so Sam's making friends. Or she's trying to make friends. The rain just got loud again. What is that? Um, I don't know if y'all caught. Okay, um, well, I'm just gonna pretend that that is Sam being obsessed with the X Files and not my crazy uncle. Bratmobile, that's cute. Lol. Closing drawers. Grab mug. Put back. Grab mug. Put back. Matches. Put back. Um. Okay. We're gonna go in here, we're gonna close, we're gonna close this, we're gonna turn light on. Dear Miss Greenbrier, Mrs. Greenbrier, I would like to talk about the stories that Samantha has been writing lately. They're, they are what I would expect from the little boys in class, which along with a few other tendencies I've observed bring me a bit of concern. Why? What kind of stories is she writing? Unless it's like, no. The Heathen at the Edge of the World, Samantha. So this is like one of the stories she wrote. Oh no, this is so cute. Okay. It's got turtles and pirates. Captain Allegra looked off at the ocean. It went on forever, or so it seemed someday. You have to hear that. I'm not leaving. Captain Allegra looked off at the ocean, it went on forever, so it seemed someday she would find the edge, get to the paradise there, and then she heard a cannon fire. Boom! It was the black pirate ship. She yelled, I thought we'd lost them at Horse Island, the first mate said. Looks like you thought too soon. The black ship came up along the side. Captain Black himself came out of the deck of the black ship. He yelled to Captain Allegra, Yar, never. Very cute. Gonna find the edge. There ain't no paradise, par paradise, like a pair of dice. Very nice. So how old was she? Uh, grade two, so she was seven? Okay. And your father were a liar. Liar. Captain Allegra yelled back then, why do you keep following us, you imbecile? Wow, she's definitely testing out her vocabulary. Grade two. The first mate yelled out, We'll stop you, Captain Black. We'll find the edge of the world, and you'll see her father was no liar. The battle kept going until Captain Allegra's ship got away. Now west, she said, and the ship sailed towards the sunset. Huh. Well, that's cute. I don't want to leave. I actually think I might end this here. Because there's a lot of stuff. There is a lot of stuff. Uh, I'm scared. I'm just gonna... And the rain outside, and I'm hearing noises, and I don't like this, and... Oh, is there something in the trash? No. But, okay, so I like the... I like the... I like the... Let's talk for a second. I like the journal diaries. Very cool. Very neat. Very exciting. Oh, the thunder just scared me. I just jumped. I... Wow. Woo! Um, voice stories, very cool. Noises upstairs slash in other rooms of the house, not cool. It's so dark, if I'm in here with a ghost, I'm going to cry. Uh, you literally, I was silent, you could hear that. I'm done today. But if you guys wanna see more videos like this or you wanna see more episodes of Gone Home, do click the subscribe button and click the bell icon to turn on my notifications. And I will see you guys next time. Bye!